Hey everybody, and welcome to Chris, Why Would You Eat That? Today we're eating something in a bag. Uh, more specifically, this is some kind of product. Now, the funny thing about calling it something in a bag is I don't really know what it is by looking at the front of this bag. All I know is it's Camel something or other. That's the brand name, I assume. And that is apparently premium quality. And it's terrifying looking sort of red chippy things. Um, there is a little bit more information on the back. It says chili tapioca ican bilis. I have no idea what that means. I know chili is terrifying. And uh, I mean, tapioca, I guess, I, I think tapioca is a kind of root. So I'm assuming this is like a tapioca root. I don't know what ican bilis means at all. But we can rest assured, it is a premium quality product according to the package. So the Camel brand can't possibly be letting me down, right? Right? So why don't we uh, crack some of these open here? It's, it's sort of, it's actually, it's, it's, it's not like chips. It's like a big sort of lump of chip. And it's a little bit squishy, which is terrifying me a little bit. Let's, I've decided to cut them open because I didn't think I'd... Oh, oh my God. That initial smell was insane. I have some water on hand just in case, but it's, it was like a vinegary spicy smell and it just took over everything in my nose. Upon, upon looking at these inside, they're still kind of terrible. It's a big kind of lump of red broken chips. So, well, there's no more stalling at this point. I have sort of a, they're kind of sticky, but here we are, a lump of, <coughs> they're kind of, they kind of have a barbecue-y smell, but they're broken. So here we are eating chili tapioca ican bilis, the premium quality product by Camel Brand. Let's see if they, they taste good. They're not that spicy. Well, they're, the spice is coming. They're kind of crunchy, but kind of sticky. And it kind of tastes like it's not good. Oh, here comes the heat. It's kind of like ketchup and barbecue potato chips combined. Kind of sweet, though. It's definitely getting hotter the more I chew on this. It's not pleasant. Oh, I just ate like a piece of the, it's not a chip, it's like just a glob of the, the, the coating. Mmm. And the aftertaste is awful. They're a little hot. I got some water. Oh. So we can we can let's, let's let's look at this package again. They are made by Camel. We can't argue with that. Premium quality. I'll be honest, they weren't horrible quality. Like they crunched kind of okay. The coating is not balanced. That's the one thing I'll give it. It's kind of all over the place. So sometimes you get like you can see on the front here. There's just a big glob of coating. When you bite into that, it kind of tastes like an off barbecue potato chip really sweet though too i mean chili there's definitely i've got heat and i'm not comfortable right now it's not like burning it's not like i want to just run out of here but it's not i don't want to eat any more of these at all tapioca i'm assuming that's what the chips are highlight of this thing i would probably eat more of just these tapioca chips but maybe without the chili gross sticky stuff i don't know what ecan bilis is still there was no, no sort of clue. Like there wasn't something else in those. There's tapioca chip, chili chips. They burn. They're kind of sweet, and there's this weird taste that, like you first taste the 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 the, 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 the at first the chili's not the flavor is not that bad. It kind of tastes barbecuey. 
Then it kind of gets this like sickly sweet sort of ketchup-y barbecue, like cheap barbecue sauce. And, and then as you, as you crunch down a little bit more, you get this weird taste that just made me feel uncomfortable. I'm sure if you go back and go through it, you'll see that moment. And then it just kind of leaves you with a bit of a burn in your mouth. So, I mean, it's not that bad. It's, it's kind of terrifying that, I mean, because I had no idea what, what these were. But, uh, I mean, I don't want to, I'm not going to finish the bag. But I, if I had a friend who really liked sweet chili things, they might enjoy these. I'm, I'm, I'm not a big fan. So, well, thanks for watching another episode of Chris, Why Would You Eat That? Where I ate some kind of weird tapioca chili chip. Uh, as always, you can follow us on Twitter, at Candy Critic. Or go to CandyCritic.org and find links to all of our other social media, including Facebook, Tumblr, and Instagram. Uh, you can also go to Patreon.com slash Candy Critic, where you will get all of these videos in advance. You'll get a whole bunch of bonus content, and you'll help support us making more videos, writing articles, and updating our website, which is what we're doing right now at CandyCritic.org. So thanks for watching another episode, and we'll see you next time.